Good morning, folks. Opening shot here from the solar orbiter of Mercury eclipsing the solar limb. Look at that planet photobombing the sun. Disrespectful. Anyway, folks, the CME impact that began yesterday morning still has not stopped. We've got updates on that and more solar activity. Good link as well. We'll get to the last 24 hours on our star. And we have had a couple more M-class solar flares. No Earth-directed CMEs, but a continued increase in overall activity on our star. We also have coronal holes, as you can see, and the plasma filaments are active as well. You can see several of those here. Some coming into Earth-facing position will need to be monitored. Primary area of focus is on the north incoming as it has the most active sunspots and plasma eruption activity. So here's the solar wind, and you can see that indeed, this CME impact has continued in an extended duration impact. This is actually a very good thing because it means the impact effects are lower. The KP index is climbing this morning as the secondary components impact. And despite the underwhelming totality of the CME event, we have seen several items of interest like the factory explosion in Ohio. There was an uptick in electrical fires and system glitches yesterday. This is the sort of event you'd expect. While the primary time for those effects should be today, it appears they've already started. Like wind speeds exceeding forecasts in over 60% of the low pressure cells worldwide, we also had a seismic uptick. Hopefully this is all there will be, especially in Turkey where they could honestly use a break. Top story from the journals today hits the pre-earthquake electrical activity in the atmosphere above the 2008 Alaska quake. This is covered in detail in Chapter 7 of Weatherman's Guide to the Sun, conceptually. Big quakes give themselves away beforehand. By the way, do you know how many ambassadors and emissaries from the West left Turkey right before their big earthquake two weeks ago? Probably just a coincidence. Anyway, grab your tickets to our upcoming live in-person events at the link below the video. South Carolina is sold out again. San Jose is close as well, just four spots left at that one. Don't forget to check out our store as well. Limited time to grab those soon-to-be-retired items. All links are found below the video in the description box. We greatly appreciate your support. Subscribe and we'll do this all again tomorrow. Right here, but right now at 6 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.